Hey everyone, it's me. I want to make a video because a lot of people ask after they find out that I'm an estranged parent, how is it that I smile? And I'm going to let you know it's not easy, um, but I think over time it, it becomes easier. Um, I look at estrangement and the stages of it as a rainbow red initially you see red because you're angry and then orange you know it's a little bit lighter red orange yellow you know sometimes you walk out you see the sun a green can represent the grass when it starts turning you know green <laughs> blue when you see once in a while look up and you see a blue sky so on and so forth and so I think my healing came over time. It came in stages. It wasn't easy. I started to be thankful. First 20 years of my life, of course, was with my own family at home. And, and then I was blessed with the opportunity to be, get pregnant. I, had two, I have two daughters. I gave birth to two healthy children. I was given the opportunity to raise them and be a mom and have all of those experiences. And then at the age of 40, after 20 years, they were both gone per their choosing. And um, I had to say, well, now what? And I had to start to, to work on myself. I had to start to heal from previous traumas. And I had to start finding joy and I had to accept their choices. I had to respect their decisions and I had to believe that the job I had done as a parent was good enough. That I had raised two amazing daughters who are out in this world and I hope that they are passing the love that I instilled in them onto other people. and. That sometimes, you know, we are allowed to be a parent for a day, a week, a month, a year, five years, ten years, twenty years, etc. So, I just want to say that I had to revamp myself. <laughs> um, I was single for a while, and ten years after my estrangement, which was about three years ago, I met someone who is now my husband, and. I understand what it's like to be with a best friend and I have a partner. I have someone that if I got sick I know would be able to manage the house, take care of everything, pay all of the bills. Um, it, it, he, he does everything. He did everything on his own before I met him so I, I found someone who is my equal who I can share my life with. I'm not saying marriage is easy. No marriage is easy, but I, I, I found I have been incredibly blessed and fortunate to have been given an opportunity to find love in this world and to have someone who supports me, walks with me, encourages me. I don't know. We just like being together. He's my best friend, and that's just the way it is. So I also pour myself into other people. I'm uh, give, I've given the opportunity to be a, an extra grandma for some children, an extra aunt. Um, my sister-in-law has a little girl that she is taking care of that is I spend time with and she's almost five and she is a light. She is a joy and I had her overnight recently and we just had fun. I mean <laughs> it's amazing so I'm not saying this journey is easy I'm not saying I don't miss my children I'm not saying that I don't wish we were together but for me I think relationships have to flow and they have to be uplifting and positive on both sides and if uh, you know that's what they choose that's they're right. So I just have to say is the sooner I accepted their choices and respected their choices and 
understand that if are we going to reconcile i don't know i i don't know but i now focus on what i can see touch taste and feel and hear um and i focus on those who focus on me so i hope this helps someone um i know the the journey of estrangement is is difficult uh, has it been the most challenging in my life it's up there um i've suffered great losses i've had great challenges and this is just another story in my book and I, I believe my story helps others so know that you are not alone and I'll be back